What's up, my dude? Let's go today! Zach, look here today! I am excited because we are going to be doing um, a Bendy animation crossover with Hello Neighbor. It takes me so long to do these things, but I, I love how much support you guys give me. So basically, what I do is I take models of Bendy and I put them into the editor for Hello Neighbor and I make animations. And now I'm taking the animations that I worked so hard on um, in my last one where basically Hello Neighbor <laughs> or Bendy and Hello Neighbor came together into my apartment and did shenanigans, <laughs> but now I have brought Bendy and Boris back. So basically, before I show you all this stuff, basically in our last episode, Boris took over with the neighbor, and the neighbor and Boris were working together and basically kicked Bendy out. Bendy got kicked out of Hello Neighbor's house. Now, this is all confusing you. Um, you can check out the other uh, videos. I'll, I'll probably put one of those things, the eyes, in the top right so you can click if you haven't seen those, but basically, our story is Bendy, came up to the neighbor one day and then <laughs> Bendy moved in with the neighbor and Bendy became our neighbor. And so then Bendy uh, started battling with the neighbor. Bendy started dancing and throwing parties at the neighbor's house. And then, what is it? The neighbor eventually beat him in a chess match. This sounds weird, but then kicked Bendy out. And now Bendy is kicked out and Boris has moved in. And you can see Boris is dancing like, <laughs> I won, you lose, <laughs> and Bendy is mad. I mean, he's obviously smiling, but he's like, I'm gonna get you. <laughs> and so, um, I mean, these animations are terrible, but they're animations. It kind of brings life to these models. So, I mean, it's kind of cool. I added also another one that they're, they're not showing up right now. Um, I might have to play it in a new window instead of a standalone game because sometimes they mess up. But you can see, Bendy's doing the robot, and Ben, or Boris, Boris is doing the robot, and Boris is walking into the street, and he's, I mean, I guess he's sliding. <laughs> it's so bad. Boris is sliding into the street doing the worst robot you've ever seen in your life, but they're in the game. They're in the world of Hello Neighbor. When the night goes down in Hello Neighbor City, and the sun doesn't shine on bent day. <laughs> Ooh, I wanna be there with my bent day. Whoa, whoa. See, now what we could do is I wanted to add more of Bendy stuff. And we're gonna add Bendy and basically Boris is gonna be boarding up the house. He's gonna be placing his hands on these doors, stopping Bendy from getting in. And when Bendy can't get in, he can't be with the neighbor. And now Bendy's mad because basically he's just been outed out in the situation. The neighbor is not hanging out with him anymore. And it's just a bad situation. Now, the neighbor's not walking around right now, but we can add some more of the neighbors. So um, I'm going to be right back. I'm going to do all that stuff right now. And we just, let's continue this. So I'm back into the game. It does look a little bit different. I'm playing it in a window instead of the standalone edition because I edited a bunch of stuff, so I'm excited. So we still got our angry Bendy here, and we got a giant fence now that's <laughs> just kind of running along the border of the thing. Um, well, let's, let's go through these animations and kind of see what's going on here. He's still dancing up front, showing off to Bendy like, aha, Bendy, I have won. The neighbor lives with me. And then the neighbor's all frustrated like, why are you dancing in the street? We have plans. We have to stop Bendy from ever getting in, which means we must set up the traps and lock the home. So he's getting frustrated. So Boris is here and he is uh, dancing here for us. And so he put up this fence to block out Bendy. And as you can see, the, the fence is kind of blocked up, uh, <laughs> blocked up a little bit of the, the car. So what happens next is Boris walks up and Boris is up on the door and he holds it closed and the neighbor's like, yes, this is how we're going to do it. We're going to stop Bendy from ever getting into our house. And so once it's closed, Boris stands there in the window. <laughs> and so Boris is kind of making fun of Bendy. And you can see Bendy, this is why Bendy's getting mad. Bendy sees Boris and Boris is just doing all the negative things. He's laughing, you can see the animation. He's like, <laughs> oh, that's cool. So, so I, he's like, get in here, come on, let's go, let's go. So can I get around, can I, yeah, I can't even get inside. Come on, Boris, you're blocking us. I don't even have anything to get inside. So I'm gonna see if I can get inside here. Uh, come on, let us in. Come, he's actually locking us out too. Boris, let us in the house. Okay, so once we get inside, this is what it looks like. Hold on, here we go. I actually put in a random animation of, of the neighbor like freaking out. So we can have him looking and he's like, oh no, Bendy's thinking about getting in. <laughs> he's like, oh 
Oh no. <laughs> yeah, what is this? These are some weird animations. I, 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 these are the ones that the, the creators made while this is one I made. He is kind of floating a bit. So, um, that is a bit weird, right? I mean, so he's floating. It's weird because if you listen, there, there's a bunch of like sounds of like, hmm. Huh? Okay, but b b Boris ends up pointing in the, m the mirror. Or the mirror. The window. I keep calling these mirrors. I pull it in the window. I'm just so excited. So basically, he calls him in like, hey, Bendy, get in here. And he's like, what are you doing? Don't tell him to get in here. He's actually going to think about it. So in the middle of the night, Bendy sneaks in. I mean, you know, Bendy. Bendy's all Bendy cool. So Bendy ends up doing the same thing we do. Bendy breaks in. And so when Bendy breaks in, he destroys this whole thing. He walks through. And he goes, you know what? I'm moving back in. So he opens up the door. And as you can see on this thundery night, he ends up falling asleep in the neighbor's bed. So we did what we did in the last episode, or two episodes ago, where, oh, is it? Bendy moves in. So now Bendy has moved in. And now I don't think Boris will like that. So Boris was thinking the entire time, like, haha, I won, you can't get in. And so basically it looks, you know, you can see like Boris is like, what? How did you, how did you get in? And then, so this is all what Boris was before. He was all happy and excited. But when Bendy broke in, that's when it's going to change. And so I want to actually bring in a, bund of, a bundle of Bendy's, a bundle of Boris's. <laughs> so I'll bring in a bunch of Boris's. And so in this situation, we can say that Boris figured out a way to clone himself. And if we figure out a way to clone himself, he can use that to stop Bendy. And so we're going to uh, cut to what we're going to do is we're going to set a box right here. Boom. The box is now a figurative button i guess we're gonna make it a button and so we open up or not open up but we take this umbrella and we're gonna dip it in the hot fire and we're gonna summon all of the borises into one room so as we stare into the furnace into the fires boris appears with all of his clones and when boris appears he uses his powers he's frustrated every single one of boris comes and he says, come with me, Bendy. And Bendy says, no, I'm going to sleep. And he's like, no, Bendy, get out of my house. This is mine in the neighbor's house now. No, I'm just going to, I'm going to sleep here. It's like, no, get out. And then all of the Bendys show up and they're like, come with us, come with us. And you can even see the giant one like, <laughs> he thinks he can win. <laughs> so we have all of these, all of the Borises show up. But Bendy, Bendy's not scared. So Bendy just stays there, and he sleeps. Every single one of them believes that they're powerful enough. And all of the Borises show up. The neighbor. Where's the neighbor? The neighbor's now, uh, now still outside. He doesn't want to get involved in this. Ever since he's worked with, you know, the Bendy and Boris and the Ink Machine, everything's just been going a little bit too crazy. But Bendy's still sleeping, and Boris is getting frustrated. And Bendy murmurs in his sleep, I can destroy you with one snap. And they each stand there. They don't believe him. And he says, you want to try me? Leave me sleep or perish. And the, the Boris is still staying around. But the neighbor heard of this. And the neighbor, the neighbor is jumping out of here and trying to get out. You can see I took all the animations of the neighbor trying to jump out. And it's like, just imagine in slow motion. Do, 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 do. do, do, do. It's like the neighbor jumped. And is getting out of there. And you can see this is a little bit different. This map is a, it's kind of like a reworked version of the alpha. So we can kind of get the similar look as our other episodes. But the neighbor is out of there. And he's like, no. And so Bendy. Bendy is now going to finally get back at Boris. As Boris sits up onto the bed. He points at every single one of the Borises. And tells them. You shall never, ever betray me again, Boris. He looks at them. With the snap of his finger, he uses all of his power and deletes every one of them. They all go, and all of the clones disappear. The only Boris that remains is the real Boris. But the real Boris is now a stomach sickness because <laughs> of all of the, the, the things that he just had to go through to make clones of himself. And so he throws up, trying to, like, get the toilet to work again because he's throwing up so much. So basically, Bendy put Boris's head into a toilet and made Boris basically turn back to his normal self. And now Boris and Bendy 
are even. Bendy still feels bad though and gets mad and goes out into the middle of the street. We're gonna go over there and see what happens when Bendy gets mad. With all of his rage, he says, if you ever mess with me again, Boris, I will beat you. And he raises, and he's like, I am bigger than you, stronger than you, and more powerful than you. I am Bendy. I am Bendy from Bendy and the Ink Machine. Don't mess with me. <laughs> so, I, uh, I had a great time here today. Let's actually bring all the stuff in and let's look at the stuff that we did before. All right, so I brought it all back in. So here's Boris again. Here's Bendy angry again. I feel like I'm tongue twisting over my words because it's exciting bringing all these in and all this, all this work, all these animations that I had to do. So basically, we got a story here today. I actually want you guys to write the next part of the story and I'll make some animations to go with it. So what do you want to happen next? The, I'll, I'll take the best comment, the best story, you know, and we'll relive that one. So let's see, what do we get to do today? We got to basically explore what it was like, uh, basically when Boris and Bendy are fighting, you know, and the neighbor is coming into the middle of this trying to help them. Bendy was actually friends with the neighbor. Bendy was our neighbor at one point. And when the neighbor came back, he was not happy and ended up kicking Bendy out. But Bendy is more powerful than anyone even knows. So Bendy got back. Bendy can do whatever he wants. It is insane, and I, I've had so much fun here today, so we got to do a bunch of stuff. So Bendy is actually, you know, back into the house. We can actually make him do, you know, uh, some crazy new stuff. We can make it so that Bendy goes to a different place, maybe with the neighbor. We can make Bendy and the neighbor stay on an island together. So we can do whatever we want because this editor is amazing. I can add some new anim animations because... Um, I can actually make a little bit of them. I hope that I can do it a little bit better than what I've been normally doing because these are kind of a little bit lame, but it kind of tells our story. So I had an amazing time here today. Hopefully I made you laugh, entertain you. I just want you guys to just have a great time. If you're having a bad day, you could just come and watch some Dak Blake and feel a little bit happier. So thank you guys for watching. Um, hopefully you guys can come up with some great stories down in the comments. I read everything, so thank you guys for all your support. I've been trying to comment back on a lot of stuff. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video. And as always, peace out, my dudes.